What's up, everybody? The C A R L O S Cars is today. We're acting to Honest Trailers. Five Nights at Freddy's. Yo, usually I don't do find, uh, Honest Trailers, but it's Five Nights at Freddy, and I went to see it in theaters, enjoy the atmosphere in the theater with so many Five Nights at Freddy fans in there. People were dressed up, people brought their plushies. Um, and yeah, it was a great experience. It felt like watching Avengers Endgame again with the Marvel fans. And oh, it was a fun time. I enjoyed the film. One of my friends said it was mid. Um, my, my, little ne my nephew enjoyed the heck out of it. He was tearing up. Uh, it was an awesome experience to go in theaters with the FNAF community. Um, cheering, uh, screaming, like, yo, it, there was a lot in going in the movie theaters with the fan, them, and it's amazing. Um, tell me your guys' uh, experience in theaters. Uh, how was your in theater experience? I, I was trying to get the pizza. I know Regal Cinema was doing the pizza. Uh, wasn't able to get the pizza. But boy, I I was wanted to try the pizza out. I, I bet it was just a regular pizza with the box. But hey, I would have kept the box for the uh, souvenir. Anyways, been uh, into Finance Freddy since the first. I think it was the first one or the second one. I think the second one was Birdie coming out when I got into it. Actually, yeah, when the second one came out, I was getting into it. My friend was into it when the first one came out. Uh, my little brother was the one who got me into it. Him and my and my friend, um, and I have a whole a lot of collection of Five Nights at Freddy plushies. I have the original Foxy, Bonnie, uh, Freddy, Bonnie, Chica, and Foxy. The original four plushies. <clears throat> I have. I collect like the Phantom set, the uh, second wave. Uh, most of the sister location, the only one I didn't get was um, Fun Time Freddy. That was the only one that I had to get. I did get Bon Bon. Uh, I got Balloon Boy. Uh, got Exotic Butters. I was getting mostly the exclusives for sure. Uh, but yeah, I wish I got all of the ones that I wanted to get. But anyways, without any further ado, uh, put the original video in the description down below. Subscribe to the Screen Junkies. They do a fantastic job with these honest trailers. And without any further ado, I want to know what their thoughts of the movie. So let's get into it. Let's put the bottom up. From indie game developer Scott Cawthon, prove that we all got to start somewhere. Comes an adaptation of his biggest hit that pulled off the sets, animatronics, and deep cut references that define the franchise, but forgot to follow one simple rule don't make everything else boring. In what feels <laughs> like more than Five Nights at Freddy's, do you pay rent? then you're probably too old to know about FNAF, the game equivalent of a jack-in-the-box. That's either a game about watching screens until monsters pop out, or a metagame about grown men screaming until view counts go up. <laughs> but the real reason behind its staying power is the steady drip of dark and twisted lore. Okay, I'll put it this way for the olds. Imagine Pong, but after every round, they hint that Left Paddle got molested. <laughs> you make a six and a half foot look menacing. You call five and a half foot actor Josh Hutchinson. He's playing Mike, caretaker of his sister, Abs. Hey, Abs. 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 Abs, you ready? Mike's your standard deadbeat dad archetype in brother form. I don't care. Do whatever you want. I'm hardly fit to be raising a kid. We. Oui. Want Abby. <laughs> because he's too busy searching for his other missing sibling. By taking pills and hoping the answers come to him in a dream? Yeah, I actually tried that for my forklift operator test. It's not gonna work. <laughs> he's not asleep, 
which is most of the movie. Mike's hanging out with this Dr. Cop MD, professor at large. Can I uh, help you, officer? I'm a certified EMT. Wow. Oh. You really didn't do your homework, did you? As they join forces to protect his sister from a ridiculous over-the-top villain. <laughs> no, not Freddy. You are wretched, rotten little piece. Not him either. And this degenerate is who they entrust with the well-being of a mentally ill child. There she is, Aunt Jane. An evil caricature who's scheming to take Abby away because, to, um, hmm. Man, he's broke, so it's not for the child support. Yeah. Why would you hire a lawyer and a goon squad to take a kid she doesn't even like? Maybe she's the killer. Maybe she took out Mike's family. Maybe she's the yellow bunny Abby tried to warn us about. I mean, obviously not. But if we stretch that out for 16 more minutes, we got ourselves a film theory. <laughs> theory. Meet the animatronics haunting Freddy Fazbear's Pizzeria that shockingly came out looking pretty legit. Oh, that's why. Controlling these ghost child corpse mascot turduckins is William Afton, yet another American business owner trying to automate his workforce. Played by fan favorite Matthew Lillard, who's completed his quadrilogy of gangly guys obsessed with death. Together, these <laughs> monsters will terrify your imagination and only your imagination because this PG-13 movie comes pre-censored for your next middle school sleepover. <laughs> Okay, you guys, mom and dad are asleep. Put on Willy's Wonderland. <laughs> theater, because you definitely are paying for Peacock for a film that's like the Avengers for little cousins and baby's first horror film for everyone else. <laughs> But did so well at the box office. We're sure to get 100 sequels. I always 100 come back. sequels. And every indie game with an annoying fan base is about to get the big screen treatment. No. No. <laughs> no. <laughs> <Starring> <laughs> Charles Unemployment Cheese. Pilot the Ella Abbey or Garrett will have to do it again. We have Jennifer Lawrence at home. <laughs> now, this mask and see who you really are. Mm. Why, it's old man Lillard. <laughs> Don't tell Mike the babysitter's dead. Ooh, I, yeah. I thought of these. Scare, bear, bear, stare. Oxy Cottontail. <laughs> what does the fox slay? <laughs> and jump scare. Just kidding. Jump scare. Never mind. Jump scare. Made you look. Jump scare. Got you again. Jump scare. Okay, I'm done. Jump scare. <laughs> Nights of the Living Dead Kids. It's not just their ghosts that are inside of those machines. It's their bodies. Why would he stuff the bodies into big animal suits instead of just cooking them into the pizzas? The children's menu pun is right there. I'm hopeless and awkward and desperate for says. love. It was also the night that the skeletons came to life. Pizza, pizza, go in tummy. Me so hungry. Me so hungry. <laughs> Ma, they're making me say weird shit again. <laughs> that was a good one. That last one was a good one. Oh. Okay, so. Oh, no, man. Ah. Maybe because people, yeah, for people who didn't know too much of Finance Freddy, it's, it's a movie for not for them. Um, but yeah, it, 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 I, it's a good starting horror film for any kid to start watching if they want to get into horror. I think this is a good start uh, for them. But, whew. Yeah. <laughs> He's right. Yeah, what was the reason for the aunt to take the kid? He's right. I, I thought it was the money, but after he he pointed out about him her hiring the the goons and the lawyer, it makes uh makes no sense now. It already doesn't make no sense now. Yeah. So <laughs> I hope I hope they improve with the from the, I heard I, I hope they learn from the what they could improve for the second film, because I could see them improve. I, I, I hope they improve from this one from the second one a lot. <clears throat> I know there are some plot holes, but they left it like that. 
Forge sequel. So, yeah. And I'm happy it was a success. Just... Hey, a lot of people was waiting for this. I remember the time when they had fake uh, fake trailers out there online of Five Nights at Freddy movies. At the Five Nights at Freddy movie fake trailers. They've been there for quite a while. And finally, now that the film came out, it's a, it's a dream that came true. It's, it's a, a thing that the community have been wanting for a long time. And yeah, oh, that's all I had to say. So that's the end of this reaction, guys. I hope they get market player in the second one. Uh, because uh, I know it was a time, uh, time conflict, but anyways, that's the end of this reaction, guys. I hope you guys enjoyed it. If you did, smash the like button, subscribe, and not subscribe to this channel. We really appreciate you guys to do share this video to any final Freddy fan. And I'll see you guys in the next video to upload. Adios.